Have you ever heard a song so haunting that it's said to drive people to despair? A song so chilling it earned the nickname the Hungarian Suicide Song? Today we're diving into the eerie history of Gloomy Sunday, a melody that has been surrounded by legend, tragedy, and mystery for nearly a century. Our story begins in Hungary, 1933. The world is in the grip of the Great Depression, and despair is everywhere. Enter Rezo Ceres, a struggling composer, grappling with his own heartbreak and misfortune. One dreary Sunday, Ceres sat down at his piano and poured his soul into a melody, a melody so dark and sorrowful that it seemed to echo the hopelessness of the times. The song's original Hungarian lyrics, written by poet Laszlo Javor, tell the story of a heartbroken lover mourning the death of their beloved. The lyrics express such despair and longing that they end with a wish to reunite in death. Heavy stuff, right? Here's where the legend begins. Shortly after its release, rumors started swirling that Gloomy Sunday wasn't just a sad song. It was a cursed one. Allegedly, people who listened to it were overcome with unbearable sorrow. Newspapers reported a series of suicides in Hungary, with some victims reportedly clutching the sheet music of Gloomy Sunday in their final moments. Now, whether these stories were true or just sensational journalism is up for debate. But the song's reputation grew so notorious that it was banned from radio stations in Hungary and eventually in the United States during the 1940s. In 1941, jazz legend Billie Holiday recorded an English version of Gloomy Sunday, bringing it to a global audience. Her version softened the lyrics slightly, adding a hopeful twist at the end. But even then, the song's eerie reputation persisted. So is the song really cursed? Or is it just an urban legend fueled by coincidence and the power of suggestion? I'll let you decide. Today, Gloomy Sunday is seen as a masterpiece of melancholia covered by countless artists and studied as a cultural phenomenon. Its haunting melody has inspired everything from films to conspiracy theories. But one thing is certain, this song has left an indelible mark on the world of music and mystery. Now, if you're curious to hear the song for yourself, I've included a link to the original version in the description below. But listen at your own risk. Whether you believe in the curse or not, the song's heavy emotions are very real. So, what do you think? Is Gloomy Sunday a cursed song or just a tragic masterpiece misunderstood by history? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell.